Right, last one of the day. Yay. As he says, is it's uh, starting to get a bit dark now. So the Daimler arrived this morning and uh, we've just got it in, giving it a dry out. Terrible weather today, real miserable and wet. I've just taken about 65 photographs for you, uh, just to enable you to get a bit of a feel for what we've got. Not a bad car, this. I'll just give you a bit of a tour around on the video again so you can get a feel for it. I've just been for a little trundle up the industrial estate down to uh, towards the other end there and back. I can confirm it drives quite nicely. We will hit the start button in a minute when we get round to the front. Quite a usable Dame the V8 we've got here with a tra fantastic amount of paperwork. I'm just gonna show you that in a minute as well. But yeah, nice inside, nice on the dash. Radio headline is good. I'll flick back in a minute. Headline is all nice. The usual suspect areas around the rear window there look good, interior lights are working. There she are, she just started at the touch of a button. Bless her. And she's ticking over there nicely. We've got two Daimler V8s in, they're actually running on eight cylinders, which is lovely. Because normally speaking, they're running on seven and a half. So that sounds nice and sweet, and there's another lovely silver grey one at the back of the building there that also sounds equally as sweet. The information, VIN number, identification, uh, call it what you will, uh, I photographed that a couple of times down there, so you can get some info from that one. I'll just wander round again and shut the doors, which all shut quite nicely. Should have done that on my first trip. There you are, shut nice. Um, usual, again, usual areas. Just a little bit behind the indicator there. But it's okay, it's holding it back. A little bit around the side like there, usual areas. But again, nothing disastrous, it looks quite smart and level. A little bit of silicon, little bit of micro blister, just a little bit here and there. But again, nothing, nothing mega. It still looks quite nice, look. Door bottoms, sills. Someone's done a little couple of little local blow-ins there, look, on that rear door. But in all fairness to the car, in actual fact, it sits and I think represents itself quite well. Because if you watch the video on the silver one that I done oh, a week or ten days ago, same round there, that little bit there. Um, yeah. They're normally they're normally a fairly weak car to be fair, and the doors tend to bulge out where people have lashed them up and all the rest of it, and the seals aren't much better and all round here is normally a bit of a car crash and so is around the front and all you name it yeah but um, we know we've got two very presentable cars uh, very presentable Daimlers should I say this time which is nice uh, hopefully the video has given you a bit of a feel for it and the photographs as well next stages I think is to come down have a look see what you think oh paperwork nearly forgot uh, my brother stood with some of it yeah we have got literally lots and lots and lots this is you know these are these are loads of paperwork here look buff log books and invoices and bills and bits and pieces and loads more there there's loads there loads here gosh there's loads handbook and so forth there some more handbooks there some more handbooks there some more handbooks there a lovely uh history folder that accompanies the car which is nice so there you are that sort of sums it up like i was saying next step come down have a look See what you think.